So anyway, um, we're going to play some Warzone and, uh, and enjoy some of this if possible. I'm going to grab some, some lads. I think Dave is in the call. Hi, Dave. Hello. hello. How are you? I'm doing good. How are you doing? A little headache still. Ah. I slept for like two hours before we started, um, before I started streaming. I just kind of got home from the studio. And I was like, yeah, it's time to, uh, it's time to sleep. But I'll be yeah, alright. what's up, homie? Hey, dog. And, um... What's up, Desert? What's up? Hey. I mean, I think your Discord broke, because we're not hearing you in Discord anymore. Me? Yeah, no, I don't uh -oh. hear you now, man. No? The silent treatment. Oh. At all? Mm. Can't even sign in. It's cool. I also really wish um, this game didn't start so damn loud. Well, one of the reasons I'm playing this is there was a big update. And I haven't played through the new game mode. So I want to check it out. And I was in the mood to shoot tonight. If anyone's wondering where Perfect Dark, Destroy All Humans, or Paper Mario are, I just didn't have it in me to finish a game tonight. I was just, like I said, low stakes. Would be really, uh, really good for tonight. And Risk of Rain is always just a, like a good... I don't know, man. There's There's some kind of zen to that fucking game. I really enjoy just getting lost in it, and uh, it's fun. So, yeah, I'll probably over the next couple days. I, I was thinking about taking a little vacation again, just because the weather is still nice, but then I see that it's going to be like an 80% chance of rain at the Catskills, um, which is a mountain range chat in upstate New York, uh, on Saturday. So I'm not so sure about that now. And that that's a shame. There's a high risk of rain, that's correct. Any Labor Day vacation? I don't really like going on vacation during like holidays where everyone else is on vacation. I kind of just like to lay low and chill. Most of my vacations include driving, walking, exploring, finding some food, playing some guitar. Good enough. And then I just disconnect my uh, phone from, from my life a little bit if possible too. Also, I can't load, like, Discord or Call of Duty right now, so I don't know what the hell's going on here. Say Labor Day again? And I got dropped frames. Monkey see, monkey do. Hmm. Yes. <laughs> Well, that seems to work. Uh, I'm not dropping any more frames. I'm still not able to be on the internet right now on Discord, so I don't know what the hell's going on there. I guess I'll let you know Apple Music put Redbox. Back on, so that's good. I don't know why anyone would use Apple Music, but that's up to you, I suppose. Um, okay. <laughs> Unable to access online services. I didn't mean to throw shade at Apple Music users, it was just, it was instinct. Vinny, I had this issue one of the times we played. You had to restart. Alright, chat, I gotta restart. 
I have to restart. I got I got nothing right now. So please um, bear with me a minute if you want to watch the stream. If you need to hop ship to a different streamer, that's fine. But I'll try my best to be back shortly. Um, I'm going to restart. Things got real fucky. Good job, Activision Blizzard. Well done. I don't know how it managed to crash other applications on my computer, but that's a rare feat. I'll, uh, I'll catch you in a bit, chat. If you, if I suffer the curse of shiny happy people, so too must you. I'm back. Uh, let's see if this works this time. At or from like, ooh. Can y'all motherfuckers I... hear me now? <laughs> yes. Can yeah, you I hear can us? hear you. Yeah, I can hear you. Cool. So you can hear now? Yeah, you sound a little crackly though, Desert. Oh. Uh, isn't that cool? That's the wonder of Discord, dude. That's so so cool. I, I really like when Discord crackles my audio too. Yeah, I don't know what to do about that. <laughs> right, you sound a, you sound a little better. I guess it just had to take a minute to like maybe maybe I had to just kind of like join prop. I don't know. It's hard to explain. It's weird. Uh, fucking Discord. Anyway, uh, hi everybody. Welcome back. We're gonna do Warzone. Uh, you guys have been playing this a little bit more than me, right? Yeah. Yeah. I, I would say that's a safe assumption. Desert's been playing a ton. <laughs> every, every minute of the day. <laughs> Pretty much. He, he's in the zone, the war zone. Yeah. If I, uh, if I, you know, if I had the ability to play like a little bit more, I would. I like it. It's fun. It's good to shoot. This is kind of like what happens with uh, Counter Strike for me. If I really get into it i'll just i'll get addicted for like two three weeks and then i'll just stop um oh by the way jeff if you're interested in getting in here too later after a couple matches let me know gotta restart the fucking game again yeah it's awesome we were just talking about while you were gone we were like trying to get into a party together and none of us could see each other online and we had to like join through weird menus i like weird menus yeah, yeah gear we can get you in here too i think i'll, I'll try to it's hard to rotate sometimes because it gets so easy to just play again but I'll, I'll we'll do a couple matches and then if uh if we have some time and we will have some time i'll get you in here i don't mind rotating out i play this thing all day okay so uh How do I join you, Sphinx? I don't even know anymore. You clicked uh, <laughs> accept. Join game. Pause installation of shaders. Well, wow, it's so close to being done. It's 92% <laughs> on the shaders. Shader installation paused. I, I have to leave your, your match, man. I gotta leave it. This is the next gen experience, man. Oh, it has to optimize Warzone as well. Of course. It doesn't? Okay, so then we'll just join. Uh, I'll just join. Whatever. So you're not going to be able to do the event that was going on yesterday. I think that's going to be like done at specific times. They have like a schedule for it. So, but Kingslayer Trios is pretty similar to what it was it's just it was just a team death match with objectives and then everyone ran for the bomb well what the yeah, you should, from a it's bomb just trios though you should try it uh that's just point. trios yeah we can, we can uh, do a, i can like, dip out if match. you want no let's cool. do regular and then we'll we'll try that later yeah it's fun it's good for leveling your weapon all right you ready to rock and roll boys yeah no right. so uh, may i ask uh what games you you all liked? Give me a couple games from today's thing that you enjoyed from Gamescock. Uh, I abstained from uh, partaking. 
in the viewing of the event. I appreciate your viewpoint. Honestly, I, I can't even really recall a whole lot of it. It was a bunch of trailers I had seen before, and then, like, I don't know, the new announcements weren't exactly something I really paid much attention to. They're just, they're just noise to me. <laughs> yeah. I mean, the new COD looked good in the pre-show. I, I guess so. <laughs> Fucking uncanny Ronald Reagan. All right, now we're going to commit some more crimes. <laughs> it's been the meme online since... That fucking thing Press was announced. Press F to start the war on drugs. Use this time to practice. God. It's just funny to see, like, here's a real-ass person. And, like, it was way more uncanny than I thought it would be. It had the Tarkin effect. Let me lower the game. I looked good. It's just, like, it is very uncanny. You're right. It's just weird. It's just weird. But anyway. I want to see the zombies mode with all the presidents again. What do that you mean shit again? was really funny. When did what? they do that? Yeah, what was that? Ah, uh, it was one of the previous Call of Duties. I was that Black Ops One, I think. It might have been Blops One. No, oh. I didn't know that. Like it was just like which president? A bunch of presidents killing zombies. Yeah, in the White House. It was really, really hammed up. Okay. Um, Dave, what did you like from today's presentation? If the you only, watched? the only thing that really caught my attention was teardown. Oh, that looks all right. Yeah, actually, I forgot yeah. about that. That was the destructible environment one. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a big, big blast core fan, and I'll take anything about destruction. Yeah, that looks good. JFK, McNamara, Fidel Castro, and Reagan were the. <laughs> Yeah, that's it. That's who they were. All right. Oh yeah, struggling. Didn't they show that? I don't know what that the, was. The, the flesh meat game. Not oh, Reagan. God, I'm, I'm, oh yeah, I'm the squad leader. the uh -oh. flesh meat. And there was uh, Nixon, not Reagan. It's probably gonna end around TV station, but I could be wrong. Yeah, let's go there. Desert, the fortune teller. There, um, I try to predict the circle now, man. The, the Walking Dead bridge constructor was just, uh, it made me roll my eyes harder than a zombie. We got at least one team coming here. Like, what do you do yes, with do. Walking Dead property and bridge constructor? It makes, I, I didn't understand that, but you can I don't construct understand zombie a lot forts. of things. Yeah, I, that actually yeah. sounds kind of fun. Yeah, yeah. I downed one outside. There's one on the, uh, the roof. Okay. Gotcha. I'm in the oh, TV they're station. Up. They're getting There's up. One. There's one yeah, more, and in, I'm up in, They're, they're, they're getting up and healing each other up there. Right Try and get inside if you guys can drop down through the like glass. Yeah, I'm, I'm about to, but I might get shot doing this. Three on the roof now. I made it. Did you? So there's three uh, of them up there. Did you get some uh, guns? I'm dead. I, I got a a gun. Yeah. Uh, so nice, how do you? Uh, <laughs> Nice grenade, dude. So, no, Sphinx, how do you tag things again in this game? Oh, left alt. Oh, left, left alt, alt yeah. Boy, it even says it right there. There's one down. It even says it. Oh, man, this place is hot. It's hot. It's getting hot. <laughs> they really do me, though. Uh, help. I'm coming to... All right. It's Gula Gola time. Got a gun. That'll work. Survive, you've earned your freedom. I'm a coming, Vinny. It's okay. I'm dead. Uh, I'm just oh. trying. Uh, oh, I'm trying my mind. best to remember. I, I'm not coming, then. It's been, a, it's been a while since I played this, so I just need to adapt. Oh fuck! There was a, I think what another group that came in. Shit! I downed like three down. people, but fuck! I kept it's downing fine. them, but I couldn't Breaks finish them off. Are we all gulag now? Yeah. Gulag gang, boys. <laughs> It's the warm-up round. We can help each other. Yeah, we can cheat. Chad, did you did you see something um, that I did just then? And relay information. Nice job, Vin. I don't know how I did that, and I'm very proud of myself. And there's no way that this is gonna continue. Maybe it will. Oh, you're headed for lumber. I've decided Desert. not to go to TV station again. Yeah. I've 
Is there, are you watching a good place me? to go. Which side you on? There's a dude in the middle. Sniper Ooh, that, that okay. was some cool fucking weird lag. Where is uh, he's going uh, for where a cap? Are you guys? He's going for a cap. Chat, we'll uh, let, Dave, we'll let you're them really handle. far away. We'll let them handle that stuff. It spawned me really far away. That's I'm weird. gonna get a car. It's no big deal. We got a buy station here. Uh, we're kind of broke right now. Yeah, got a dead cow here. Has been cleared for redeployment. I'm back. I gotta say, you weren't really missing that much with the in-game event yes, thing that they did. I mean, you could still do it, I think, when they redo it at a certain time, but it was it was a little weak. What was it? It's just a literal ad. It's just team deathmatch with a literal ad at the end. You get a yeah. you get a blueprint for a DMR, but that's it. Yeah, it's it's uh there's like words flash on the screen. Oh, I see a guy right there. I only have a shotgun. Big come back to the come back here, dude. I'm it's too yeah. late. I'm hiding. Do you have a gun? Yeah. Ooh, shit. Where the fuck was this guy? I Where would this? love to help you. It's all right. But I have a pistol and a shotgun. Okay, down to dude. I just didn't expect and his there to be is here. Ah, oh, fuck. They have a riot shield. They have two riot shields. Keep keep scooting back. I can get you. I can get you. Cool. I'm dead. Careful, though. Let's go. All right. We, we should... Uh... Find armor. We for example. Yeah, yeah, we should find some armor. Let's pop on over here. Let's leave those guys to their business. Here. I have one you can have. Be very careful. Ooh, Honestly, armor box. Here. I feel like no game in this mode really has truly begun until you get your perks. Yeah, true. I feel like I the door just opened, Sphinx. I don't know. I could be wrong. Uh, they don't open, really. Never mind, then. Oh, wait. You mean on the building? Uh, well, in the building we're in. I, I hear just... footsteps, oh. so... Oh, yeah. They're definitely definitely they got motherfucking riot shields. Go out. Go out. Let's leave. Yeah, you have to counter riot shields with either the FMJ perk or a Molotov, which was a good call you just did. An enemy team is hunting you. Stay alert. Where'd they go? Oh, well, looks like the riot, riot shields on the floor. Sphinx, here comes another one. Well, the riot shields are dead. Oh, that's you. Stop. Fuck, yeah, sorry. Jesus. Those are. I didn't see a uh, a team wiped. Did, did you? No. No, there's another one. Nah. I think in. he's out behind Sphinx, uh, behind you. I thought I heard him out there. Nope. It's weird. He might have ran then. Possible. We are very scary uh, gentlemen over here. Uh, Thank God see. I had a Molotov. Yeah, I that did, Molotov I, was it was the perfect counter. I couldn't even kill them both. Yeah, yeah. There was no way. There was no way. That's like one of the only counters like, to that. We weapon. gotta go. If you if yeah, you're at a yeah, bad I, angle, I they're I'm invincible. Sure. Oh boy. Uh, we have enough. Oh! On the roof. Ooh, they're oh, dropping in. I think there's two on the roof. Yeah, but Just get down here. I, I don't know, man. I would I would leave me. <laughs> Damn. If I didn't really have a good gun for that, I only have a shotgun. And a sniper rifle. Yeah, so. it's all good. If I had like one more second, I might have been able to aim and shoot a little bit. But hey, that was uh, a good warm-up round. Yeah, you want to do another one real yeah, quick? Yeah, yeah. Just right. jump into a couple more. Just get the warm-up rounds going. 
I'll drive. Let's go. Why don't Desert and I have numbers? Yeah, I, I don't know. That. This game, numbers? this game, th there's been something weird with the like social shit recently. Oh yeah, it's broken to hell. It never makes sense. Nary says I'm online and offline at the same time, and I believe him because I've seen that. Yeah, I've joined on one person's name and a totally different. I joined a totally different person's game. Excuse me? You're yeah, in another person's like, game right now? No, not right now. In oh. the past. I tried joining on someone on my friends list and it joined me with someone totally different. It was pretty cool. It was like, surprise, I guess we're playing. I'm stuck in like in hell right now. There's like nothing's happening. Yeah, it's uh, loading. Oh, is it? Is it really going to do that? Maybe. If you want. Did you know that, sir? I don't care if you want. <laughs> Do whatever you want. We're holding for deployment. Steve Holt. Oh wait, no, it's Steve. Different Steve. Steve Rule. Oh fuck! It's an IKEA. No, it's really not an IKEA. There probably is some facsimile IKEA here somewhere, but. It's all an IKEA. What are you talking about? I wonder if if uh, that that would make a cool map for like a game like this. There is a store that has IKEA colors, but it's more of like a a Costco or a Smart and Final inside. Hostile dropping into the area. Watch the skies. What? What is IKEA? Is Swedish? Yeah. Yeah, they got meatballs there. That's pretty sweet. Ish. Over. <laughs> Time to see what you have learned. I hit a dude one time out of five shots. That's pretty good. I mean, realistically, you only need one to hit, right? If it were, I guess, if he has armor and stuff, but you know. Realistically, though, you would think, like, if someone got shot from a bolt action in the chest, even with hurt. armor, it, they might stop for a minute and, like, you know, get the wind knocked out of them, at the very least. They might cry. But this I'd Call of Duty action man cry. kept running and shooting and drinking fuel, gamer fuel, and it was just like, wait a minute, how do you do that? Oh, uh, where are we dropping? The promenade. Promenade? Maybe Odo's there? Um, yeah, I say we go to purple. Promenade. Okay. Just, just cause downtown's gonna be a fucking shit show. And at least here we can find Clark's bar. Oh yeah, I guess adrenaline. If you get shot, the adrenaline would keep you going. I didn't even think about that. There's like a video of some dude who was... Hang gliding and he didn't. Going in. And he didn't um get strapped in and he had to hold on to the instructor the whole time. And like was this at the rodeo? At the rodeo. I'm sorry, I missed the first part. They filmed the rodeo, that's right. Oh, um man. he had to yeah, but they didn't strap him in the hang glider and he had to hold on to the instructor like the whole time. It was and, and it was Oh, a hang glider. You fight him inside, Vinny? I'm good. You don't okay. have to say it. I got a harpy monitor. He was Ooh, Dave, 14.1 meters from us. <laughs> he was, Dave. 17.6, two of them. I'm coming over to your building. Body on my they are right here. They're probably up on top. Yeah, they're on the roof. I got armor okay. over here and stuff. I'm getting nothing on the heartbeat. Oh. Help! Oh, two of them. I got knocked down. Yeah, one's on the roof. I'm, I'm climbing Is down the building. one on the ground? I might have knocked my opponent down, but I don't know. Um, so... I think we did. I think we knocked each other down. 
3.9 meters. Okay, yeah, someone's down here. Ah, uh, his armor is broken. Finish the story. Oh no, it's just some dude was hanging up, hanging just, off of their instructor on the hang glider for like three minutes, and the adrenaline, you know, gave him the strength to continue, I suppose. Oops. Actually, I don't think any of them are on the ground floor. I just ran around the whole damn place. I downed one. Oh, there's one still one up here. I, I don't have armor. Someone else needs to... In inside? No, we're, at, we're at, the, uh, at the roof. Okay. You could try going up the other, uh, other stairs. Behind us. <laughs> <laughs> Sloppy. Back to the gulag. I smacked them all dead. <laughs> I, sm I squad wiped them. Nice. Good. With melee. Whoa. Never mind. Someone there. There's one, Dave. Just one. All right, I'm coming back. I need, for us. I need a legit weapon. You guys still got people in that he building? He is waiting for you, Dave. Just ignore him. Yeah. What up here? Yeah, well, don't go up. I'm don't going. go up. All right. So what do we do? Leave. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't see anyone on the roof. At least, maybe he fled. What is that noise? Fuck that noise. It was a sensor grenade thing. A snapshot? Yeah. Yeah, I threw it. Oh, that was a door. Dave. Whoop. Enemy UAV overhead. Let's see if we can find the dude on the roof. No, I'm not gonna even bother with that. No. Sphinx, you gulagged? Nah, they're uh, gone. No, I'm back. I'm, no, I'm Sphinx back. is down I'm here. Right behind you guys. All right. I really need ammo, though. Yeah, we all, I think we all do. Or at least I definitely do. So uh, let's see. I have pistol SMG ammo. AR LMG ammo. What do you need? Because I just dropped a bunch. Uh, I just need uh, LMG. Hey, U UAV. Mid caliber here. Wall caliber here. You got a UAV? Use yeah. it. Wait, you have yeah. one? Should I use it pop now? That shit. Yeah, yeah. Pop it. That Behind Send us. It mm, watch out, desert. <laughs> okay, yeah, I saw. Uh, they're on the roof. Running into this building. Across from us. That roof. Yeah, I go. We can probably get them from the top of this building if you want. Yeah, yeah, good idea. Oh. Gonna search the bottom really quick. Out of fuel, returning to resupply. They're probably going to be watching the top of this building, so be careful. That seems accurate. Yeah, they're jumping all around the uh, that yellowish building. Oh, actually, he's running. He ran away. He went down. Uh, Moving. over there. Moving. I don't know if you saw more than one there, though. You know. I'm I'm thermaling right now. I don't see anyone, but you know, uh, if, tag if you see anything. Right now, I'm not seeing right. really anyone. I hear shots, like from the west. I saw a bird. Am I still crusting really bad? No, no, I don't <laughs> no, hear anyone crust. Okay. Um, let's see. We don't have a lot of money. We could go probably loot the fire station the place over here. Mark out. The going. fire house. Got right. my Bruin. Does it, do you still have a heartbeat sensor? There's an yep. epic assault rifle here. Um, no one's here. Or they might have ghosts. I don't know. Let's, uh, let's head over here. 
Eh, I don't need this. Yeah, my weapons aren't great right now, but... Eh, do I want to snipe Honestly, one? you'd be surprised at what the good weapons are in this game, because some of them aren't even, like, legendary. Any bullet's like the, a good bullet. The Bruin oh was ridiculous until just a few days ago, and that was, like, a common one. Enemy UAV overhead. Uh, this place has been slightly looted. I don't know if it's been completely Enemy looted. UAV overhead. Nah, this place is a pick. I got a field upgrade. Armor, Mun munitions. What's that? Wait. Oh shit. We gotta. I gotta go for that. Just ammo. All right. If anyone needs ammo, I can drop an, uh, munitions. Yeah, all uh, of us. All of us get some. I need perks. We can go get our loadouts, but they're a little far. Oh, they're not that far. They're in the ah, middle of... They're, like, completely out in the open, though. Vinny, what's the lore of Call of Duty Warzone? Is there? Probably. Uh, soap. Water? You're a man. Don't Wasn't use, that the name of one of the dudes? Use soap on your balls. Uh, yes, there was a dude named Soap McTavish in one of the duties, right? Yeah, what? yeah, yeah. Yep. Yeah, That's he good. did everything. Th that's the lore. I wonder if he smells like so. Definitely that. If he smells like war. Ugh. There's a smell. Once you get it, you can't leave it. It'll always right, be on you. Perks. Mark out, I'm going. And my good gun. X-ray spotted. Hang on, never mind that. Contact. Chat, there's someone over there. I'll go this way. How far are they? From us? <laughs> Pretty far. I don't know what boat out to use. How far are they? I don't know what. The... Chat. I don't. I don't know if I have good loadouts. What? What? What am I using? A double time, hardline, and shrapnel. What, what's a good EOD ghost tracker? Is that what I'm using? EOD is good because you can survive random explosions, and you'll. It'll only take out all your armor, and no matter how much armor you have, it'll only take that out, and then leave eighty percent of your max health. So it's good for like. Surviving one blast. Okay. Uh, ghost is necessary because you're invisible on UAVs and heart monitors, except for like, I guess, advanced UAVs. Okay. Everyone shows up on those. And then, what was your third one? I don't know. I don't remember. But I, apparently, the, the perks are That's good. Okay. According to chat, the weapon I chose was pretty piss poor. And they're right. Is it? Is it amped? Ammo. Amped is a good one but to have a your third perk. Ooh, ammo. Super fast weapon switching. Nice grenade. Yeah. So that's risk of rain button. <laughs> and I really need to not press that button. Uh, do, do one of you guys have like one armor you can spare? I have many yes. arm or. Yes. Oh, there you go. Thank you. I wonder if I should use the car um, 98 instead. Yeah, I'm going to grab the car 98. I like the car 98. We, we can head. Uh, uh, I don't really know if heading in downtown is a good idea. We could head across to port and, go. like, go across. There's some homeboy over here. Contact. Ooh, oh, that's the most wanted. That's yeah, like that 6,000 bucks. Yeah, but... Well, that means they picked a, uh, a bounty. Someone wanted oh, to Oh, right, know. I keep thinking of... Yeah, you hit player. that different mode, dude. I've been playing that too much. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Someone wanted to know in chat about, uh, Halloween spoops. I've been saving up a bunch of horror shit. For October. I got a lot of good ideas for October streams. But I'm not gonna tell you what. Just World of Horror will definitely be played. Um, I know Jeff has had a lot of good recommendations, too. And I'll Oh, probably... the Spellbound! Yeah, I have fun. That, that thin... You want a fun sniper rifle that explodes? Yeah. Okay, get this one. No one else is using it, sure. Yeah. So that is explosive rounds. It's... I think it has thermal too, right? No, it doesn't have thermal, but explosive oh, no rounds thermal, sounds but... nice. Yeah. Keep the car and pick up an assault rifle as a secondary. No, I'm good. I like the um, machine gun, light machine gun I have. 
It's not really a sniper rifle. It's just a crossbow. It's a, a crossbow. <laughs> but I'm I'm cool with this. It has the shorter range. It does, but it what it what it does is amazing. Well, it certainly do. You're not wrong about that. I just tested it out. It's it's cool. <laughs> Check this out, chat. Watch this. <laughs> ah, da boom. Oh, helicopter. Enemy helo. Helo. Not happening. I tried. I guess we can see where the circle's gonna go. Gas is moving in. You save zone that would have been a good clip, though, had that actually worked out. It looks out. like it's going to be between stadium and lumber, so that's gonna suck. That's just a big open ditch. I uh, hear stock up on armor. You're gonna want deployable covers for where this is going. Body armor here. Then you would have had 2k plus 2k viewers if I had landed that shot. I know. It's not poggers, bro. You know what's cool, though? I'm what? bad at video games, and people like my streams. <laughs> and Matt, if I was good at video games, I wonder if people would leave. I wonder if I just have the opposite effect. I don't know. Would you even be you at that point? No, I wouldn't. I, w I would be, like, yeah. kill feast Broski. 420. What would I be? <laughs> Dave? Broski. 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 You'd be bro. a bro. I thought bros were more jocks, though. Like yeah. Scoot. Not, like Scoot's not, a bro. These days, bro these days, everyone's a bro, though. Yeah, that's true. Jabroski. We can, uh, we can camp out on this roof. For, oh, yeah, we can. Circle. If you want. Yeah, well. Where are we, uh, which roof? This one? The one me and Sphinx are on. Okay. I'm sorry, Sphinx and I. Yeah, there's a ladder, like, right here. I'm glad you corrected oh, yeah. yourself, because I, having <laughs> a certificate of English corrections, I'm able yeah, don't to embarrass myself, you know. Yeah, I can I can tell I can tell you when when the words is right. <laughs> you do. You can is. So, I see a team on top of the stadium over there and there's oh, yeah. some guys also over in the port. Like kind of around there, they're they're like behind the shipping containers. Yeah, I mean you could give away our position. That's fine. <laughs> <laughs> They'll never know. They'll never know. Ooh, I got a hit. Don't just don't make yourself too obvious. Okay. Don't don't go like Robin Hood up there. there I can't reach them anyway with this thing, so. Someone uh, keep an eye, like, down below, too. I, I doubt we'll have that many people running from the direction we came, but it's possible. Mm. That can happen. We're right on the edge, like, the crust lip of the, uh, yeah. of the, the, what is it called? The, the gas? The, the brap field? The ring of fire. I like to live my life on the edge. The stink zone. Oh, that, that's good. The sphinx stink zone. <laughs> Wait, why'd you add Sphinx into that? Yeah, I, what's up with that? It just rhymes a little bit. <laughs> I haven't met Sphinx, so I don't know if that's true. That's that's all I mean, hearsay. maybe Smelly? I don't know. All I, I know is either. someone kept... Is, there's Sphinx, one of your friends tells me in chat about the secret gnome, and they want me to ask you about it. I don't know what that means. 
which secret now? There's multiple? Yeah, why not? Gas is moving in. New safe zone located. Alright, well, we're gonna have to move here. Just. Contact. Just ignore the conversation. Don't even acknowledge the secret gnome. That's fine. Oh, this is a fake radiator. Oh, we got guys dropping down. Hold on to it. From where? I'll shoot him with my crossbow. Uh, kind of where Dave was pinging a lot. Okay. Oh, <laughs> yes. Keep in mind we got people behind us at the port, too. How's that? They're okay. more to our right than behind Ammo us. Ammo crate in this room. Did you shoot someone? Oh yeah, I just downed someone, yeah. Gas is closing in. Help! Thank you. How many? I don't know, yeah, one's down. Oh, well, I, nice. I downed one, um, so that might have been part of that squad, but I'm not sure. Yeah, it wasn't a squad wipe, that's for sure. Vinny, are you playing against AI or actual people? I don't think there's an AI mode in this game. Like, on in Warzone. No, it's just peoples. Oh, that's you, Desert. Sorry. Wait. Oh, you're out there? Moving. No, I shot you from behind. Oh. Moving. Where's the rest of that person's team? I don't know. That's Maybe they were a straggler. Could have been just two. Ah, uh, that's true. I, I forget people join, like, random squads. There are people up there? Yep. I just tagged the two people fell down uh, came down on parachutes. Dave, you okay? You, you the door. Whoa! That's me, that's me, but where is the Whoa shit? Alright, team wipe. At least that's one team. Uh we have enough to buy desert back. Where's um, the nearest? Oh, I see. It. It's in the right zone. There. Oh, we got to be careful. There are definitely going to be people over there. I got my ass beat. Sucks, man. We'll get you back. Your teammate is in the gulag now. If they survive, they ran oh, up you're and in, you still head. have gulag privileges. Yep. Okay. Not anymore. Area is clear. Here, uh, drop your, uh, w w actually, wait, there are people around here. Enemy UAV overhead. I don't like that UAV. Uh, uh three, three, to three to our right, right here. I want my gulag. I'm back. Setting charge. I want my weapons back. I called in an airstrike, watch out. Actually, they don't affect me much. And I didn't get anyone. Careful, Des. Careful. Yeah, we got Careful homies. is what I do best. You're losing ground. Behind us. Well, I was all gung ho for no reason. I was like, "Well, if I hit the shot, I think that'd be real cool." Didn't hit the shot. Over there. Damn! Oh, he jumped up. He was on. He came from right from behind us. How? Yeah. Well, that's a shame. I should have used my my damn light machine gun. Time? Top 13, eh, bud? Oh, that's all right, I guess. I, I just that was bungle. It was a little bungle. Right. Let's let's do one more in this current configuration, and then we'll. Ah, uh, you just you just left the party. Oh, oh that's awesome. You should uh, you should be able to join. Mm -hmm.
So now it's time for me to learn how to play shiny happy people on the guitar. All right, we're doing one more quad. Yeah. Quad. Exactly that noise. So it's uh. <laughs> yeah. It's like a D. It's like a D arpeggio kind of deal. <laughs> Fuck this song. I, I, you know, it's funny too because, like, there are people in chat who were like, Vinny, I hate everything about that song. I'm like, yeah, me too. And here I am now playing it on guitar. So chat. Meet me in the crowd. Oh, I'm out of tune. I'm in drop D. That probably explains it. This is not Red Vox content, chat. I'm not gonna do this anymore. Vinny, it's about Tiananmen Square. It's not sweet, it's sarcastic. Didn't they just get the title from that? And then, because Michael Stipe in interviews has said that the song is pure, like it's a kid song. He straight up has just said it's a kid song. He's probably totally telling the truth. Oh my god! Did, can someone please clip that? Did anyone see what just happened on my screen? How someone fucking turned into a red mist after landing in the helicopter rotors? Yo, the mist walkers? Ah. I just saw it. That was insane. That's a cryptid, bro. It's the water saw cryptid. One? That means you dude, that means you're cursed. It's the water cryptid. Fuck. The only way to get rid of the curse is to watch Paprika on DVD. Desert. Come on, man. No, we're, <laughs> we're see now we're we're not doing this desert, because I already did the I did the other thing. And uh Alright. You gotta, you yeah. gotta wait like at least a a, a, month. a year, perhaps. But, um, <laughs> I, don't, I don't even have a DVD player. Oh, wait, yes I do. I could use the PlayStation. Never mind. If you could uh, make it work. Ooh, let's, let's go to Ikea. Okay. Need a DVD player. You've got VR chat. It's true. I'm still really pissed that that Gaki channel got taken down. That was, that was a lot of fun. Even if it, I only watched it for like yeah. an hour in that one night, I was like, man. I was like, this could That's be a, th a nice thing to watch every now and then. Uh, we got get, a, we got some the possible home. gamers uh, along with us. I'm sure it'll come back again. Yeah, but it, it's not on. Like the the experience on Twitch was real nice because everyone got yeah, to chat and enjoy it together. Oh, that's you, Desert. Right? Eliminate all targets in the AO. All right, fellas, we gotta stop shooting each other and shoot the enemy. <laughs> like that that's, happened that's like at least the generals, three times up here. I, I believe the generals said that in every major war as well. All right, fellas, we gotta stop shooting each other. <laughs> Big speech he makes before they win the final battle. All right, now listen up, lads. We've been shooting each other a whole lot. Get to the target. Let's see. Ooh, that tell us where some crates are. That's far as fuck. No thanks. Now you know, soldiers, we can't unlock kill streaks unless we cooperate. Someone down here. Whoa! Oh, two of them. Great. They popped up like a gopher and shot me in the face. Yeah, it's time for <laughs> it's time for me to live. Like point blank. Your teammate was sent to the gulag. They'll fight for 
Gulag. Dave's down. Oh, I live here. I'll be, I'll be joining you all in the Gulag. I think quads are way harder than doing, like, solos. They Even are. duos. I didn't really have a whole lot of ammo. That was stupid. People are hyper-aggressive in this just because, like, their teammates can revive them. Because they have TTV in their name. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, you gotta be go hard if you have TTV in your name, bro. You have to. You have to. Because, you know, the, whoever you, gotta... you just you kill is gonna open Twitch right away. And exactly. see that you're not streaming, and you're not and poggers. Be disappointed. Ooh, all right, I'm coming back. A fight has started. Oh, there are multiple many. gulags, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. All right. Well, it looks like we're on the other side of the map. I threw a rock at him, Desert. You got this. How is this dude not dead? No oh shit. Well, that sucks. I <laughs> shot him like six times. If you lose, you're done. Earn your way out. We're sending you back to base. He's the strongest person in the entire game. Yeah. I so, can't believe I had to fight fucking Hercules. So I right, died. So I died. I'm out. Dave. Yeah, Dave, so there, uh, some of this has already been looted. Oh, sorry, I mean so, Huncules. Keep an eye out. And along came Zeus! Uh, aiming at feet to assert dominance. Yeah, I was just thinking about, like, how cool it would be. He's probably totally telling the truth. I need fucking ammo, bro. That clip was- I, I tabbed out this- the frames got crusty because I tabbed out, but I just wanted to see the clip of the, the person turning into a blood mist. Looking for that cash. Don't worry, I'll get you back. So, so it's a. Uh... You know they could <laughs> stop that song, that Hercules song, like right at, at along came Zeus, and it would accurately describe a lot of the lore. Just cut it off there. The song's done. There's an aid station here. Dave, you're pretty far. I'm also oh. pretty dead. Oh boy. It's up to me now. I mean, I could just die if you want. You seem to be having fun over there, though, so... Someone in chat said, how has Ben playing the guitar and playing the game at the same time? He's that good, man. Yeah, dude. Magic. You know, my boy's six-handed, Vin. He's got seven hands. The seventh one's, uh, it's the secret weapon. So my, my secret weapon is now that I know that song, I can play it. <laughs> play it. It's an earworm. Oh, you know what else is an earworm? Star Trek II, Wrath of Khan. There's an earworm that crawled I've never into, heard of that. Uh, what is that? So Star Trek is a, a, tele a television show. Uh, and uh, mm -hmm. what it is, it's, it's a show where they go on a trek to mm -hmm. the stars. Are okay. you prepared for the kind of death you've earned, little man? It's that. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I am? That's the voice that Data uses in, in masks when he does like his little voices. Masaka. <laughs> well, Dude, I love masks. Such a good I think episode. that was kind of a newish voice for you, by the way. I do I do some some modifications of old voices. Like oh, mine. You're, you're tuning them up. But I don't really think anyone uh, oh, wants fuck. an earworm, literally. You know, 
check off got uh, the year one. I mean, I've seen people uh, ingest tapeworms uh, on purpose. Is that was that porn? No, no, no. They they thought it was healthy. Oh, healthy. You have an aqua teen joke. It was an aqua teen episode, but that was actually there was, Oh man, there was some like weird diet craze at one Same point, like totally fucked up. Here. Just get a tapeworm. Here's some eggs. Try not to die. I, I'm gonna get <laughs> honestly. That sounded more like a David Blaine bit than um, someone trying to do healthy things for themselves. All right, so I just did a tapeworm. All right, it's currently eating through my intestines. I've got about <laughs> 25 minutes to live. So I'm but encased. I lost 50 pounds. I, I lost 50 pounds, and I'm encased in this block of ice in my own piss. <laughs> so, so, David, what's the magic trick? Um, me not dying is the magic trick. All right. That's a good trick. I mean, I give him credit. He's survived a lot of crazy shit. And I, I you know, he prepares his body in various ways to, uh, to live through these things. But on some level, like, I think he even admits it's not magic necessarily. It's just, he's just doing crazy shit. It's a mind freak. All right, now I'm going to stab my balls. <laughs> I'm going to have you staple money to them. I'm going to put on this clown nose and wig, paint my face. <laughs> I think they're behind you, Sphinx. Oh, yeah, they're all over this shit right now. Oh. I, I'd love to come revive one of you. Someone just said, uh, no, you're, you're getting like triangulated upon, dude. It's okay. <laughs> Borglar, yeah. Sulu, Blaine. That's, that's the combo. Run. Oh, come on. Let me get out the fucking window, man. Ah, ah, I, I hate that. it when that happens. To base oh, I know exactly what you were trying to do. Well, good game. Cool window. Yeah, I don't know why you couldn't get through the window. That was weird. I was too big. the game's vaulting just fails. I have no idea. You made I them earn tried it, though. Doing, I even tried doing, like, the Half-Life, like, jump crouch, you know? Didn't work. Yeah, I saw. I was like, like get me out of here. Did Jeff want to join? Yeah, you want to swap out? Do you want to try the... the I don't mind. I don't mind at all. Um, well, Jeff and I think... Well, let me see. Jeff, do you want in? And also, uh, Gear wanted in, too. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start a call with Gear. Just give me, um, so okay. we'll probably disband for, excuse me, for a little bit. But yeah. let me see. Swap Vinny for Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll do that. All right, I think everyone has to dip out. Uh, Jeff is good, not feeling war zone. All right. Oh, okay. I can swap out for gear. It's, but we, I, I it's only, too, it's only three you, people, you, you though. So, so we have to figure out. So me, gear, and who, who else? And desert. You guys, you three do. I the, play uh, this all trailer. day. I can, I can, it's go, it's okay. <laughs> I'll bounce. Desert should stay. I, I vote for desert to stay. Maybe we can do, um, what's it? Jankum? Yeah, dude, Jankum. Let's do Jankum right now. You got a jar? Oh my yeah. god. Okay. How do you play rock, paper, scissors with a jar? <laughs> <laughs> I can't commit to that. I'm sorry. <laughs> so, uh, no, really, though, you know, who who really, who of the three of you would like to join uh, for the, the King Slayer trio? You guys, thanks. All right, I'll stick around. Whatever. All right. We could swap out, too. You know, it's not a problem. Yeah. Easy. I, I have to get gear on my list because I haven't. So I'm popping out. Yeah. All right, man. Pop mate. off. Yeah. All right, catch you later. Yeah, dude. See it's you. fun. If you want to join in after, we can probably, you know, if we go for a little while tonight, we can probably switch again. But um, Yeah, absolutely. All right. Whatever. I'll, I'll let you know. Yeah, I'll just be watching.
right. Uh, ooh, do you, do you, uh, yeah, I'll whoa. start. A, I'll start a call. Give me a minute. All right. Ooh, I just have to add the um, uh, gear's name here. So I haven't played any Activision Blizzard games with gear, so. All right. Hey, what's up? Hey, gear. Oh, we're starting over. Now we're good. We in here? Yeah. The gamers hey. have entered the building. <laughs> yeah, what's up, gear? Nothing, man. How are you? I'm doing all right. Uh, it's nice to finally be able to play something. I mean, I get up for work at like 6.30. No, not even. Well, what oh my Six o'clock usually. What are so. you doing up now? Um. Well, I lost power earlier, so I, I took a very long nap. And then tomorrow I'm actually getting my car looked at, so I'm going late. So. All right. Um, I don't know. Is the setup for this game like really jank? Yes, always. All right. Because I've been trying to like make an Activision account for like five minutes now. <laughs> After well, I have you on my, on my list. You're on my friends list. Can you just, can I just invite you? To yeah, try it. I mean, that's, that's a Blizzard friend, not an Activision. Oh, okay. You know what I mean? So let's see what happens because I'm, I'm connecting to online services right now. So hopefully this All right. fucking actually works and I'm not just wasting time. Yeah, I was uh, like, whoa, it's voice crack there. <laughs> I was like, why why is um why wouldn't it work if we're friends there? But yeah, you have to make two accounts because yep. the game is two hundred gigs and it's one account per one hundred <laughs> gigs. <Per> gig. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure you could still invite people that you're only Blizzard friends with, but Yeah, it's still that. it's still all like it's still kind of wacky. Like, I see Desert online now, but he's showing up as someone else's name. It's if so he doesn't weird. show up in friends, click show offline friends to get BNet friends. I should be online, BNet. Uh, yep. Uh, invite to part. Nope. Can you find me? Yeah, I see you. So just join in if it is possible. Mm, there's no. There's no <laughs> Here, Vinny, you should probably be the uh, lead, the party leader. Did you give me the party lead? I, you can't transfer it, so I'm just gonna kick you, and you can reinvite me. I gotta press Windows G. Yeah. Why is it so fucking jank? Yeah, Windows G enable for sure. This is this I don't is think another. That works on, yeah. I'm gonna say only that works on Windows 60. So. Well, you're you're um. By the way, you're. It says you're offline. Who me? No, uh, Sphinx, you're online. Gears says it's says Gears offline. I mean, I'll send you my screen. I'm fucking online. I, I believe it. <laughs> it says you're uh, in a. Uh, that's weird. Here, I can try adding you gear. Maybe that'll yeah, work. Yeah, I was gonna say. Uh, let's see. Did you wait? Did you get an Activision account yet, or no? It just says connecting to online services. So uh. I tried to make one. That's the Blizzard side. The I mean, the, the no. Activision side. The Blizzard side should let you just invite me. I don't know. If it's going to be a problem, then I'll no, we'll, make I'm sure we'll, we can work this out. Now, chat, while this is happening, what would be a good rifle to have for my... Give me the ultimate loadout for my um thing here. For the drop. The Grau. G-R-A-U. What is that? M14A1. M4A1? Um, yeah, gear. It shows the Modern Warfare icon next to your name, but it says offline. Are you online in game if you go to the social tab in the upper right? Um, I'm still logging in, man. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's probably why I can't invite you. Logging in. Finally gave me the prompt. Well, um, perk. Full metal jacket. 
Bullet sleight of hands. Sleight of yeah. hands really good for this mode. Reload is yeah, I would imagine is probably maybe four grip. Just keep it simple. Grip. And then um, I guess pistol doesn't really matter because it's pistol. You can take um, for this mode. You can take overkill and get two primaries. It's this mode. You always drop with your loadout. Well, I have and EOD, when, ghost, and tracker. Yeah, you don't really need ghosts for this. For, but no, I meant in general. Like I'm making a, a kill streak for the usual stuff. Oh, for for normal battle royale. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah no, that's good. All right, uh, amped see. is pretty good. Also, uh, I like tracker too, but. I'm gonna go for a Desert Eagle just because they, they fucking look cool, but. Do I have to purchase this with real money? Yes. Ooh. I don't know why it's not letting me join. Are you still logging in? Yeah, it's still waiting for me to log in. You That's might good. have to restart your computer like I did before. <laughs> yeah. That nah, was <laughs> such a... That'd be so dumb. What, what, what if you just restart experience, Call man. of Duty and, and, and Battlecock? Try I that. Do that. And then see if that works. Alright, give me a second. Select the gangrene mod for real Vinny flavored bullets. How do you do that? How's, what do you get the gang gangrene mod? <laughs> it's in the gunsmith? Excuse me? Yeah, they have all these weird, um... Uh... You gotta pay know, for it. Gangrene. There's some- all this shit in the shop where they give you, like, bullets that, like, have dis dismemberment effects. I don't know if that's what the gangrene shit is. But there's, like, ones that, uh, are gold that turn people's body parts into gold when you kill them. It's fucking... Okay. And it's, like, 20 bucks or some ridiculous shit like that. It's so expensive. I saw someone shooting purple before. Yeah, purple. There's some like red, white, and blue shit too. Um, there's yeah, there's all sorts of colors. Who needs colors on the battlefield? Uh. Yeah, uh, I was waiting up. for someone to do colors. We thank you. Uh, honestly, this game is really just gun porn. If if you think, especially the. This thing right here, this whole oh, Giramatic has come online. Yep, I'm getting there. Meet, sorry, meet in the crowd. Oh, it is about Tiananmen Square. <laughs> he doesn't say dying, does he? Shiny, it's a, it, ironic that I'm playing a Call of Duty game and talking about Tiananmen Square after what happened. How they know your history, and then they just take down the trailer. It's like, really, guys. So it's it's meet it's um, meet me in the crowd. People, people, throw your love around. Take it into town. Put it in the ground where the flowers grow. What like corpses? No, Is like it, uh, flowers. Everyone like around, seeds. love them, love them. Put it in your hands. Take it, take it. Oh, cause like you know, take the flower. Oh, well, that's no, that was the '60s. Uh, there's no time to cry. Happy, happy. Put it in your heart where tomorrow shines. It's just this dumb optimism that makes it so infuriating. <laughs> like, I don't know how to explain it. it. It really is like just this overly optimistic so a song. They did it uh, on the Muppets or Sesame Street. Mm. They did. They covered. They played that song, but they changed the lyrics like furry, happy monsters. I know I said the forbidden word just then, but it's true. They did that. Vinny, you don't think it's maybe a little sarcastic? Oh, it is. I I totally believe, knowing the way Stipe writes, it's definitely sarcasm. But it, it's still, like, yeah, it's just this uh, incredibly catchy yet annoying song, and I and I kind of, I kind of love it, but also kind of hate it. So, John, are you? Let me, let me try inviting you now. Connecting to online services. I don't know why this is taking a year. Does it time out? Does it give you an error eventually? Nope. Vinny, you played the song a few months ago and didn't say anything negative about it. Oh. 
things change. Yeah, every every time I listen to a song, I have to immediately state my feelings of the moment right after I listen to the song. Otherwise, my it's listening required. experience is not validated. It's 2020, dude. You got to be on a song. I also keep it in a journal. How about this, John? Why don't, why don't you, Ooh, uh, um, why don't you do, why don't you restart? Because try yeah. one, one time to restart, because I had to restart. I couldn't, all I right, had to do right. the same thing, you know. So restart, we'll do a match real quick. I'll get someone else in real quick, and then no we'll, worries. um. Yeah, yeah, these ones go pretty quick. So yeah, next match we'll have you in. But, uh, cool. I don't get it. I don't know why this, this is so dumb. Well, we can thank Blizzard, I guess. Yep. Oh, well, I'll be back. All right. Vinny, I'm just surprised because everyone hates on the song, and I was happy that you didn't. Well, it's no, 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 no. You have to understand something about it. it it's, it's just that it, it gets stuck in my head for like days on end, and, and that's like infuriating. You know what I mean? Um. Yeah, it's it's hard to get it out of my head, out of my skull, my skull bones. I'm just gonna invite Nari. <laughs> Oh, shit. He was waiting this whole time. <laughs> Whatever. Nary never... loves this game game mode. Yeah, sure. he does. Why not? He's gonna be the silent protagonist. Normal multiplayer. On our crew. Whoa, he's here. He's. <laughs> we don't have a choice. We have to hear him. Hi, Nary. Oh, he's uh, he's gonna hear a big delay though. Yeah, we'll just invite him to the call then. Whatever. I think Nari's been watching the stream enough to know, you know, how we how we do things around here. Which is uh Everybody knows the rules. Everybody knows the rules. Hi Nari. Oh, what's up, Nari? There it is. How are you? Um hoping my game doesn't crash because every time I go into Warzone my game crashes recently. Wow, this is a cool game. The next yeah, kind of experience. Um, TM. Multi regular multiplayer is fine. Warzone is... Have I shown you the clips of my game just getting completely corrupted? Because no. they said they patched it. They did not patch it. Um, well, show me that one day. But it yeah, is, I, I, it is bad. I just would think, like, it's weird because you think... I don't know, I just feel like they've been at this for like 15 years. Um... Like, some of this stuff just didn't exist a couple months ago when we were playing it. It felt pretty stable. Who knows? Also, now we can't even get a match going. <laughs> we haven't played in, like, 20 minutes. What the fuck? Sorry. No, John, it's not your fault. Dude. Yeah, I think it might just be something with the servers right yeah, now, maybe. Yeah, this is... Like, this, we can't even join Kingslayer Trios with Nari in the game. <laughs> Imagine being one of those guys where you, like, spent $500 on guns that shoot gold and red, white, and blue loads. <laughs> and you're fucking, you're trying to log in to shoot your hot gold and, like, dismember people because that's what you crave. You crave to turn them into gold. And it's just, like, server error. Like, you can't turn them into gold. I mean, isn't that what that? Oh, we got it. Oh, we got it. Never mind. We're good. Here's a clip of the game just going to. Oh, wait, there's a match. OK, well, it's uploading a clip of the game going to absolute crap. Surely uploading something while you're joining a match won't cause your game to crash. Eh. It's the most, most stable <laughs> process. So um, you're going to have to explain the game mode to me, but I was uh, kind of curious about something. Which is, how are you guys such high levels in this game? What what do you play to get your level ups? I just play normal player. player, yeah. Oh. I also bought the game at launch. I took a break for a while, too, but... I still think Battlefield 4 is the superior military shooter. 
four, you said, though, not five. Oh, it's God, no. Five is an embarrassment. We don't talk about five. I liked uh, BF1. Yeah, one was surprisingly good. The, they, they took a lot of risks and tried new things. And I think it really paid off for that game. And it's it looks the, beautiful, too. Yeah, it's the only one I played in recent memory. And I liked it. But, you know, it's a shame that... I like period war. Like, I like if, if you know what I mean? Like, yeah, I know. What you you know what I mean, right? Like, I not like what you thought when you left. Yeah, I know. Um, but I, I enjoy war that isn't modern most of the time. I prefer either futuristic or something World War II or one. Or even like an alternate history war would be kind of nice. But I, I get sick of yeah. modern warfare. I think one of the reasons I like Battlefield 4 a lot, too, is the uh, the last couple of DLCs they did was kind of, like, semi-futuristic stuff that, like, kind of had Easter eggs for Battlefield 2142 uh, and stuff like that. I really um, hope they make 2143. I doubt they will. At least not as the next game. I just want Titan mode back. Like, not the Oh, that was a cool game mode. Titan was um, so much fun. They had carrier assault later on, but yeah. Yeah, it, it just wasn't the same. It wasn't the same, you're right. Carriers aren't up in the sky. Oh, okay, so let me explain this game mode to you. Um, we're on a team of three people, you just kill. That's all you do. You kill, Giant. if you die, you get dropped back in. You just, just kill people. All right. Giant you... team. Yeah, yeah have fun. There's a very small chance that we'll ever be able to stay together all the time. Yeah. But it's... if we are together, we are definitely much stronger. Oh, I see red, white, and blue loads already from the sky. Jesus, Paying that, I love it. that big buck. Oh, yeah. Prepare to get shot a lot. Like, not even be able to land shot. Yeah, so you don't you don't have to loot. The only loot is, like, ammo and kill streaks. Yeah. Um, they're, they're dudes. The dudes who have the most kills... Um, get marked on the map, and uh, you get more points if you kill the high-value people. Ooh, my, my game is corrupting. I can take live footage and show it to you after. I don't know where you guys are. I'm lost. I'm scared. I don't know. I don't know where I am either, but I'm, I'm having fun with it. Hostile dropping into the area. Watch the skies. <laughs> Wow, I can actually cheat. The doors, as they're closed, the doors corrupt and turn sideways, and I can just see through them. Well, do you have this installed on a potato? It is on its own SSD. I, I tried multiple drives. Really? Corruption so you actually downloaded this game or, like, cloned it multiple times? Yes. It didn't, it didn't fix it. The airspace is too crowded in this area. We got guys uh, over here. Enemy soldier incoming. I got one of the high value people. Well, maybe my kill streak will kill some people. Who knows? Yeah, nope. this whole mode is just clusterfuck mode. But we're do you're doing great. I didn't get a single kill, but thanks. want to go for a sniper rifle in this mode yeah that's what i do i do i take a overkill and i take a like an lmg or assault rifle and a sniper rifle so you, you should oh, be able okay. to if you hit escape you can edit your loadout uh still edit it yeah you, you can, can edit it and then pick and a different one if you go yeah it's just on the right side of the loadout okay 
I'll I'll change my loadouts, but I'll you know eventually I'll edit. Cause that that sounds cool. I'm just gonna use the car. <laughs> this is not a sniper rifle. Could be, is not. Vinny, is what, it possible the for there to be a negative sound delay because that's what's happening? Hostile what, you hear the sounds area. before you Watch see the video? Did Twitch come up with a new innovative part? Usually. Yeah, maybe they need to refresh. Minus. <laughs> yeah, I guess I could do a snipe. Eh, fuck it. I'm just gonna stick with loadouts that I have already. Whatever. I think it's just better to die to the gas at this point than run. No, actually, staying, staying near the gas is uh, good for finding people. You get all the like stragglers popping out everywhere. God damn it, Chuck. Yeah, there's a straggler, yeah, there's running, a straggler at running, right running at you right now. What's my KD ratio right now? Embarrassing. Now I'm gonna, now I'm gonna die in the gas. Your KD doesn't matter in this. No, I mean, but I haven't gotten any kills, so that's that matters. Uh, you should uh, try a different gun. I will. I'm, I'm trying a different gun right now. I want to enjoy this gun, the, the, the thrill of the bolt action. I know that feeling. That was another thing that was great about uh, Battlefield 1. And hot dogs, hand grenades, and, and horseshoes. The best weapon is, is the... Uh, I love the Garand. It's just a thrilling weapon to use. Don't go outside. Oh. Enemy UAV overhead. Has Activision put out a VR game yet? Mm. Activision doesn't put out for anyone. <laughs> How much money you got, then they'll put out. Yeah. I'm just trying to think of what franchises they have that they could use to get them to market. Like this? Enemy UAV overhead. Uh, I'd play Hearthstone in VR. That would be chill. <laughs> oh, fuck off. It's a king dropping behind us. I feel very ineffective right now, chat. Hostile dropping into the area. Watch the skies. Uh, some guys dropped behind you. Watch out. Yeah. Alright, maybe I will try a different loader. I just wanted to get one kill with that damn thing. This is better than when it's on, like, the roofs around, uh, downtown where it's just you get shot out of the sky as you're falling because everyone's on a roof well we're on roofs That's now part of a different type of roof and this yeah. is the roof of an ikea yo if you want to have some fun get get uh, an auto shotty in your loadout uh and then just drop on top of buildings and, and look for people who uh make poor life choices Yeah, we're at Ikea now. Gotta kill. Yo, you got one of the fucking high value people, too. You sound like so enthused about it. I'm proud of you. Okay, 
got a I sniper got rifle. I gotta get a better loadout next time I do this mode. So in between when uh, before we get John in, I think it'll, I'll try something out. All right. You can do it uh, mid match. Yeah, but I don't. I don't want to miss any gamer time. Ah, uh, that's true. Yeah, I know the struggle. One of the issues right now is you don't have a lot of attachments to make your guns much better. Uh, I mean there are plenty of good, good combinations that don't you don't need too much shit for. Use my kill streak, man. Oh my god. Ooh, nice shot. Those soldier care packages that have like sniping or kill streaks in them. So if you have a sniper, you can just camp those out. Try an MP7 or Growl for super cheese. Yeah, those are both pretty good guns. The MP7 they just nerfed or the MP5? Uh, no, they nerfed the, um... I don't know, did they nerf the MP5? I just know they nerfed the Bruin recently, and I think a little bit the Growl, but the Growl's still a really good gun. Team has reached 75% of the targets, chat. Just some gamer stuff. That was a hoy. That was H U E H U E. Really, this suit's hiding behind the fucking door. Allied UAV overhead. Hostile dropping into the area. Watch the skies. We aren't doing terrible. Um, yeah, half the kills of the people in first. Yeah, that's not terrible. Could be worse. Enemy UAV overhead. Yeah, we can come back. Ooh. 12 out of 5. Uh, how many teams are there in this man? Yeah, how many teams are there in this game yeah. mode? There's like 50 um, players, I think. Yeah, it's, I think, like 18 to 20 or something. Or maybe it's less. I don't fucking know. Yeah, people shooting at me. Yeah, my fucking ass over here. Dude. Ooh, spicy. I like this pig roll weapon quite a bit. Pig roll. All right, just. That's the target coming. Hit the nut. Shitty range, but good good shoots. Was that your M M4 that you're using? I don't know what the hell this is, man. I guess it's an M4, yeah. Is it a blueprint? Yeah, it's a blueprint. Nice scenario. Ally defense UAV overhead. I'll just keep using this. All right. Oh, it's the FRK. Oh, it's the oh. Of course, it's that. That's what Chad is saying. Yeah. Yes, that's a good blueprint. Gas is inbound. Marking the safe zone. Enemy soldiers in cover. Uh, Send it over. Talk about it. Right. Good copy. UAV beginning flyover. Sniper. Enemy close to strike. In cover. Gas is closing in. This is a fun game mode. I like this game mode. 
Yeah, yeah, it's a nice like uh, turn your brain off kind of mode. Is out of fuel. To and they're gonna replace you don't have them in the loop, telling them. You, you don't have to worry really about it. should just add it to a, a, a rotation or like a you know give you the option. I like when you have more options. Just, just replace plunder with this. Nobody would complain. I don't even know what plunder but is. Ah, uh, uh, bad. Do you want to spend an entire match just collecting money? No. Uh, then don't play Thunder. It also gives you a lot of XP for how like little effort you put in, which is nice. Yeah. It says Gearomatic started playing Modern Warfare. That is new. Did it yeah. get him past the? Did he get past the load screen? No, but I did know. I did realize that um, you apparently have to verify your account, and they told me nothing about verifying my account. So I've done that now. Mm, so hopefully, can. once I get past the connect to online services, which takes a few minutes, I could just log in. That's good. But you must connect to Facebook. Oh my God! Let me tell you, I apparently have three different Blizzard accounts. How? Didn't know that. One for my phone number, one for my email, and one for a different email. It's pretty epic. Yeah, dude. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. That makes a lot of sense. Oh, we're still queued, by the way, if you want to take us out for a Yeah, second. I want to take us out. Yeah. Number one, take us out. Remember when Jordy was the pilot? In, like, season one of TNG, Jordy, like, flew the yeah. Enterprise, and then they were like, you know what? Chief Engineer. He had some pretty cool hair going on in the early seasons too. Yeah, I liked his uh I liked his hair his uh he had a like a flat top. <laughs> it was so cool. Maybe it was maybe it was like, you know, cuz it's uh you know, early in the show the Enterprise D's just like, you know, doing its thing. Maybe the chief engineer wants to fly the ship, make sure the engines feel good. Maybe. I mean, he changed colors too. His well, his uniform, he changed colors. He went from red to yellow. That is true. Maybe he was just cosplaying as a, uh, as like an ensign for yeah. a bit, for for a few years. They they utilized Lavar <laughs> Burton a lot better by being the the chief of Eng the engineer chief. Oh, absolutely! Such yeah. a good choice. Um, what's a good sniper rifle? Should I use the AX50? Maybe 50 cal. Uh, AX50 is fine. The HDR, honestly, the um, the Car 98 can be good, but you need attachments to make it more competitive with those Let's guns. See. I might have that. I, I have, um... Are any of your... You probably do you have... don't. I don't. You, do you need have stuff that... Blueprints? Uh, blueprints is in where again? You don't, uh, you don't have any. I had just the, the one. I have the Oh, wait, roll. no, you, ha you have one for the car. I do. Armory, yeah. It's the Sterling, yeah. it says. Um... That's cool. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's it's got a cool. uh, tactical laser. It's got thermal hybrid. It's got sport comb. Yeah, right. it looks like it'll uh, ADS pretty fast. Um, the the main thing with the car is like usually its bullet its bullet velocity is a little low, and so is its. Uh, it's cool though. It's fine. But but I yeah I I like it a lot. I think it's great. So perks double time or EOD? Or what, uh, what, EOD what do you think? E I'd go EOD. I mean, perk three. Uh, for this mode, probably amped. Okay. Because you can that'll let you switch between your weapons really fast. All right. And uh, let me do one more thing here. Uh, and chat. Uh, well, actually, I'll just ask you. Um, maybe I'll go assault rifle or SMG. What do you, what would you do in in this case? For your other weapon. Um, I'd go assault rifle in this mode. You're not very close to people. Yes, I mean uh, assault rifle. Either either works. It depends on what you you feel like you're better with. Well, I have a, a legend a legendary. I have a, a blueprint for the XRK, so yeah, I'm just gonna just use, use that. that. That was fine before. I like that. It's uh, a good gun. If you want to see my game turn to mush, it's in Discord, by the way. Okay, I'll try. I'll check it out at the end of the stream. Check it out. Okay. It is an interesting bug. And no, it is not my GPU. I checked. Vinny, how's your headache now? It's a little better. I honestly, just groggy and weird. Um, 
like I said, I slept for a while. I'm just glad I don't have to think too much tonight or do too much reading. But I'm I'm feeling but thank you for asking, by the way. You know, it's 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 really a thank you. Uh okay, so we'll get gear in. Yeah, send me an invite. I'm still trying to log in. If it doesn't work, then I'll Nary. just call it because I don't want to yeah, waste Yeah, I can time. back out. Okay. Yeah. Well, yeah, Farewell, back out Nary. for now, and then you can stay in the call if you want. If um, But I'm just going to try to get John in. If he can't get in, then we'll, yeah. we'll take it from there. I can't. It says I can't invite you to party. Friend is All offline. Right. Try you. Can you join off me, John? Um, no, I can only invite you. Invite me. I don't know what that's going to do. Invite to group is what it says. So yeah, that's I, I think that's, I think that's a B-list that's, thing, no? Yeah, that's in the battle net. That's in the battle yeah. net. That's like the friend. So are you in game right now in, in Warzone? No, I'm logging in. It's still not logged in? <laughs> yeah. I don't think it's going to work. Uh, Sorry. I don't want to waste your time, so might as well just keep playing. <laughs> next time, why don't you, you know, if ugh, this is so lame, though, that you couldn't get in. If you can figure it out next time, we'll, we'll get a, we'll save a spot for you for sure. All right. Just, this is just a bizarre glitch that you can't join in, but fucking whatever. And don't worry about it, John. Listen, we tried. It's not your fault, dude. It's dumb Blizzard shit. Yeah. I don't. Is it even Blizzard's fault, or do we get to blame Activision? I just, I just default to Activision is fine. Before, both it was good. telling me that Desert was both online and offline, depending on which menu I checked, so... That makes sense. This is my life. You don't even have a cancel button. Nope. <laughs> I have to quit everything and reload everything to get it to let me retry to log in. Wait, did it? it what you're doing that now, or is it still not yeah. working? That's where I've been for the last ten minutes. Okay, it's weird because it does say Gearomatic is online. Yeah, no, I have no idea. Fuck, man. Well, again, if you want to stay in the call, feel free. You know, if you want to bullshit with us, whatever you want to do. Yeah, I'll chill for a bit. Were you also hit with a weird fucking rainstorm? Like, I just um, got, I was caught in a severe thunderstorm for, like, 20 minutes. Yep. And it went away, and then I lost power for about four or five hours. Oh, well, that's why you lost power. That makes a lot of sense now, yeah. Yeah, but as soon as it went out, like, I was streaming, so as soon as I, I went out, I, I stopped my stream, and I went outside to grab some something to eat, and it was, like, clear. It, it wasn't raining. So, it, like, after the rain stopped, I lost power. Which is cool. <laughs> but I found I just, out that my UPS is enough to keep me going. So I was able to stream for like two minutes in the dark. Did it just boot us from the lobby? Yep. No. Oh, nice. I'm I'm it I'm good. I was uh, not we're not in the same lobby. Uh no, the match number's the same. We're holding for the no, we're, we're good. It yeah, there Oh it we is. are good. It, That's weird. For a minute, it kicked. It showed on the menu that everyone had left. Why is the UI like your names are all crusty? Like my name, Sphinx and Nary, it's just really Enemy like gross looking. <laughs> Anyone see that? The resolution didn't change, did it? No, same resolution. My resolution changes the brand, so I, I think this game is just cursed for me because every time I boot it, the uh, the render resolution will have changed. I won't touch that setting. It'll just go to something between 50 and 70%. Again, for such a competent team of developers, I'm just shocked it's so... crustaceous. Technically, the game is still very loosely based on the Quake engine. Get down. Enemy soldier incoming. That's bizarre. Yeah, they've... What happened is they slowly updated it year after year for like 15 years. And over the past five years, they've been doing a bigger overhaul. But even then, it still has Quake code. That's kind of cool, though. D d d d chat, what is that? Chat, thing. did you see that? Yo, that was pretty cool. I edited my loadout mid while that was happening. And my gun just appeared out of fucking nowhere. Yeah, I saw oh. it. It was on my screen. <laughs> That's cool. 
Well, it's like, um... Todd not wanting to change the, the build engine. So for Starfield and Elder, Elder Scrolls 6, we're probably still gonna have build engine crusts. There's gonna be some, like, classic build uh, engine? witches. Is that what it's called? That's, the, that's the Duke Nukem engine. So, that's what engine? Creation engine. Creation. Same thing. Create, build. Is <laughs> it? So wait, they've confirmed Starfield is gonna be using the creation engine. Uh, Which means it's just the same thing. Yeah. Because... We'll, we'll never know until Todd shows us how it just works. We'll I mean, they did make substantial game. upgrades to the engine between... No, they did. They, sure. then they will continue to do so. I, I have no doubt about that. I, I mainly hope they fix their, like, animation shit. Because they're... There is so much jank with their, like, physics and animation. I mean, I part of that's on the animators, but it's part of it's the tool set, too. I don't think the engine even supports proper animation blending. Like, the modern techniques. Yeah, I don't think it has, like, inverse kinematics or anything like that. By modern, I mean, like, the stuff they were doing in Half-Life 2. Mental. Good. Good. Someone said, I'm not blaming Todd for anything. He's just the messenger. Yeah, we joke around about it. I mean... He, you know, he does have a lot of say in the company, but when everyone blames Todd for everything, it's just a meme. We know. Every wrote, company has their figurehead that you get to blame. He wrote the net code for 76 by himself. I'm not sure what you guys are saying. <laughs> by himself in a dark room over two years. In his parents' basement. Parents' basement have, with low ceilings. I have Drop heard ceilings. 76 is actually a decent game now, but I will not confirm that. I will not pay money for that game. It's come around. It definitely has. Um, I, I haven't played it recently, but from what I've been seeing, it definitely has changed for the better. Not saying it's great, but yeah. it's better than it was. Oh, I'm sure. Like, dude, Battlefront 2, Star Wars, is pretty good. I've only played like 10 hours of it, but I really wanted to play some of those Star Wars battles. I enjoyed it. I think they did a good job getting it up to speed. It's it possible like, for a game to improve. Yeah, it seems like recently that's been happening more. Like, Battlefield 4 is probably the first example I can think of recently where the launch was an absolute disaster, but they actually turned it into a competent game, and since then we've had other games of the sort. No Man's Sky, you know. Yeah, No Man's Sky being a very good example of a game that... Enemy UAV overhead. Hopefully, it, it, Final Fantasy XIV is a good example. Um, I also would love for them to fix Crystal Chronicles. <laughs> but that's a whole can of worms. The, the issue with Crystal Chronicles is they just didn't adapt it to be an online game. They looked at the original game and said, oh, we did this, and then did that. But didn't right. adapt it for 20, 15 years of game development. But also, there's a lot of crusts. Like, and, yeah, they didn't adapt it, but they, they, like, actually took features away. Like, you used to be able to, like, enter towns and see, like, you know, the families of your caravan grow, and, and you get letters, and now you can only do dungeons together. So there's a big feature of the game that was originally pretty important that's now just gone. Then you can still do that. From what you I've can, read, you can't do that. You can only do dungeons with other players. You, yeah, you can only do that alone. So you, yeah, you gotta do that alone, and then other players you do dungeons. I feel like, even if they wanted to keep it pure, to its original form, fair enough. But there is some quality of life improvements for a game that came out in the early 2000s. If they were able to add a bunch of content to it, I feel like they could have probably added some nice quality of life stuff, and really turned it into something special. So, I'm just disappointed, as usual, but that's alright. It's square. Oh wow, we're in third. Never mind, we're in fourth. Yeah, keep it up. Gamers. You will rit win a free Big Mac at McDonald's if you get a kill streak in Call of Duty. Here's my theory. The 
the, the modern advertising, like the 10 minute advertisement in this game, is the evolution of the same McDonald's pattern from like 2012. What was that? Do you remember the- there was an image that was going around, I think it was Microsoft, it might have been Sony, where it was basically the idea was interactive advertisements, mm. where it would be like, say McDonald's to skip ad. And it, it was just a picture of a person saying McDonald's. Because the idea is if you interact with an advertisement, it sticks in your brain a lot better. Stop saying it, man. Don't say McDonald's. Sorry. Oh, uh, fuck, no, I'm saying it. <laughs> well, it, it, it's also, um... Yeah, they have, uh, it's like, what would you rather, like, for a lot of streaming services, would you rather interact with an ad for one minute or watch a couple ads or something like that? Yeah. Like, watch, interact with one ad or watch a minute and a half of ads. They found that if you interact with the ad, you remember it better. Like, scummy, but... Well, yeah, it is, it is. Absolutely. There were also, like, I think... It peaked at like 800,000 people on Twitch yesterday watching an advertisement. What was the advertisement? Uh, the Black Ops thing. Oh. Yeah, it wasn't even very good. Someone said I'd rather not even have ads. Well, you know, you could use YouTube Advanced, or you can use Adblock, whatever, like, I don't... I don't really queue up ads. At the end of my stream, I do, and sometimes I forget. I know there's a pre-roll ad. Oh, Fucking goddamn it! I don't like. I don't mind watching ads or skipping them if it means like a channel like Red Letter Media gets a couple extra cents. But they are fucking annoying, and and like if people want to use ad block for my shit, I have no problem with that. I've I've always been chill with that because you know, if the shoe was on the other foot, that's what I'd want to do. But yeah, they're they're annoying, but you kind of can't do a lot without them. Like, for a lot of people and like these big companies, if they want to do stuff that doesn't require you to like sign up for a service, god damn it, fuck, that's their way around it. People expect free stuff. Yeah, but I also don't think like there's there's some predatory ad, you know, there's that there's ways true. that it's done where it's disgusting. There's the Facebook stuff. Did you see what what Facebook said about iOS 14? No. So Apple put a bunch of new security measures in iOS 14 for privacy stuff, and Facebook put out a thing to their shareholders basically saying that these iOS 14 changes could impact 50% of their business. I didn't pay attention to any of that because I was shooting a dude. I'm sorry. Give me one second and I'll ask again. All right, go for it again. So, Apple put new privacy stuff in the new version of iOS, and Facebook told their shareholders it could impact profits by 50%. Oh, I th there was a story. Yeah, that was a pretty big story. Yeah. Yeah, Facebook. I mean, this is Facebook we're talking about, so. Yeah. They're the only, with the Oculus stuff, um, I learned the other day that they are the it's only VR headset manufacturer who stores all their motion data and uploads it to their servers. <laughs> they know what you did in VR they're, chat. They're creating people. They can sense if your arm is moving in a certain manner, let's just say. Enemy UAV just tell what games you want. Oh. Yeah. Which worlds did you go to in VR chat? Senpai world. <laughs> Luckily, there are other manufacturers getting into the VR game. And Valve is very open about sharing tech. Yeah, I really, I, that's like an, you know, Oculus saying we would never require a password for our, uh, you know, logins of months ago, or years ago, rather. It, it's just like, really, Car guys? I think it was Carmack, I don't think, not Carmack, who was that? Car Sadly, they don't get to make the choices. I'm sure they don't, but it still sucks. Aww. It was Palmer. Oh man. Listen, Facebook, I would prefer to have as little to do with it as possible. So, I see Medal of Honor game, I'm like, oh, that looks great. And then I see Oculus only, and I'm like, there's gotta be a way. 
And there is Someone a way. Saying, Apparently there is. Yeah. The Someone was saying index stuff. You can use index with Oculus games with a bit of hackery. Man, look at all those Revive apps still got. exist. Has your game loaded yet? Me, no. <laughs> is it I still loading? It, yeah, it's still logging in. Never gonna happen. Well, I like using my current weapon configuration quite a bit. What were you, you were using like an IR with the uh, what the? I'm just arm? it's two it's two blueprints. Oh. So it's a Sterling. So IR with a car, and then I'm using the. Um, XRK oh, we're still in the lobby. If you want to back out, I don't know if you want to. Yeah, I want to do another one. Swap people, or if you want to do another one. John, are you in or no? No. I dropped a link in the chat though that would help you with the Oculus and other stuff on. It's revive. Index. Yeah, it used to work. I don't know if it still does. You probably still have to make an Oculus account. We got this. We're going to win this one. I can feel it. Just aim at the guy and shoot. <laughs> that yawn is encouraging me. It's putting energy into my... <laughs> my body. <laughs> I, it's really just... Like, I, I have this... I'm worried I have a cold, or... Oh, yeah. I mean, I'd rather have a cold than other things, but I'm just saying, like... Today was a real poopy day. I'm an adult update. still saying poopy. I got a server disconnected error. Bro, you're still stealing all my kills. My only option is to quit the desktop. Good. Oh, probably because I set up the BNet Authenticator. I got logged out. All right. Sorry, some sonic delayed satisfaction. Like I felt, I felt like a cool feeling was on on the way, and the cool feeling was I was gonna land and kill that dude, and it was just robbed, it was just taken from me. Awful, awful feeling when that happens. Soldier incoming. I'm sorry. There's a song from Doctor Feelgood. Who played Illin Payne in uh, Game of Thrones? And uh, I forget what the name of the song is. Keep it out of sight. Keep it out of sight. So good. So fucking good. It's just been showing up on Spotify a lot. I've been listening to it. And then I'm like, oh right, that's the dude that played Illin Payne. It's like, dude. I don't even band. know who the fuck that is in Game of Thrones. Who dude, is that? He doesn't talk. He was in the early seasons. Um, he's the, the, the muscle for the Lannisters. And he's just a weird looking dude. That's oh, okay. like a third of the cast. Yes. Isn't that the mountain man? No, there's Talk another. The not the mountain man. There's another mountain man. He's the oh, royal okay. executioner. Sorry, the executioner, yeah. Oh, okay. If you saw his face, you'd know. But like in the book, he makes like cackling noises. He's like... <laughs> And in the show, they just don't have him say anything. In the book, think, uh, he trains Jamie when Jamie loses his hand. Uh, fuck, spoiler, I guess? Who cares? Um, oh my gosh. Yeah, sorry about that. But uh, yeah. in the book, he trains Jamie. In the show, Bronn trains Jamie. I see. Yeah. It's, am it's amazing how much uh, Game of Thrones has just left the collective consciousness after the ending. Deflated completely. I didn't, I didn't watch the last two seasons, maybe three. I don't remember. Oh, then your uh, your memories are more positive. Yeah, they're pure, untainted. I've heard stories, man. He's what's, more what's like a worse? sparring partner because he can't tell people how bad he is now. That's right. What's up, John? What's what's worse? You think being wanting because the end was bad, or being wanting because you didn't get an end at all? 
No, that happens a lot. Um, well, we have both. Us Game of Thrones fans have both. <laughs> That's true, but... So... I'd prefer the sweet release of a finish. You know? Like, even if it's bad... It was pretty bad, though. It's nice that it's done. I don't have to think about it anymore, at least. I just wish they did more with the... R plus L equals J, the Lyanna Stark thing. That was the most interesting thing about some of those characters that went absolutely nowhere. But regardless, R plus L equals J. Right, it's a spoiler. I didn't know that. I didn't know they had math like that in Westeros. In Westeros, yes, they yes. Teaching algebra. Um, Lord Algebra of House Karstark. House <laughs> Cosine. That's pretty good, yeah. Oh! What I'd like, to, what I'd like to see is um, a nice Game of Thrones game, kind of like Skyrim, like in Westeros, and you know, having that that spirit and feel of the sh of the books and the show. When it was good, wasn't wasn't Bethesda approached about yes. doing a game? Yes, they was. They didn't want to, if I remember correctly. They denied. Yeah, they didn't want to do it. And I don't blame them. Elder Scrolls is better. What a cock block that was to the fucking Telltale Game of Thrones game. It was pretty good. Like I liked a lot of it. I didn't love it, but I thought it had some decent story beats that felt like a, a Game of Thrones piece of media. I enjoyed it. And then, like, you have all these choices, right? And you solve all these problems, and then you have your own unique ending, and then the series just ends. <laughs> it's like one season. And they even got a lot of the voice casts. Like, I don't think a lot of those people would, would you know... Like, Lena Headey, I don't think, would join a video game for Game of Thrones anymore after how that shit ended. If I'm not mistaken, that game was part of the Telltale Town Fall because they spent absorbent amounts of money on it and did not get the returns they needed. Now, did they spend that much money just on getting, like, voice casts? Telltale was not good with their money. Yeah. Uh, they were, from my, if I'm remembering correctly, they were pretty much always in the red. And we're running on, oh, this next game will... They, they got... Good success with Walking Dead Season 1, and they just kept trying to land another one of those by doing the same thing over and over again. Right. But they were running on really crappy tools, um, the formula got stale, and they were just bad with money and licenses. I think, I'm trying to remember who did a really good video on it. I think it was Super Bunny Hunter. Enemy UAV Yeah, I enjoyed the storytelling of some of those Telltale games. I played Walking Dead Season 1 and 2, and I did uh, Game of Thrones, and that was a, that was all I did from them. And then I got to the point where I was just like, man, I don't feel like... A, I'm not really playing a game. It's, it's more of a story, which is fine if you're looking for that kind of thing, and the storytelling is good. But, like, a lot of the choices that were meant to feel unique ended up going nowhere. And there was usually, like, a time skip in between games anyway. And then the Game of Thrones cock block was just a shame because I, I cared about some of those characters and I'm like, oh, I guess I'll never hear or see them again. Hear from or see them. I honestly don't think I've ever played a Telltale game. Uh, maybe I played a bit of The Walking Dead. Truthfully, they made for good streams. Man, my shooting is very bad. I mean, it's good shoot practice, at least, but... Sam and Max VR game? I've never played Sam and Max, so I, I can't share in the excitement, I'm sorry to say. My favorite Telltale game was probably Poker Night, and that's just because of the fun characters. It's just a poker game, but it has the heavy. I didn't even know they made a poker game. 
Yeah, they made coconut at the inventory. One which had uh, heavy Tycho from Penny Arcade, oh. Strong Bad, and Max all in the same game. Oh, okay. And Ash from Resident It was Ash. Who else? They had Gladys in the second one. It, it was basically just wacky poker. The celebrity poker. They, Telltale actually started making a by making a celebrity poker game back in the '90s, similar to the one you played. Oh. But uh, yeah. <laughs> that that's how Telltale got their start. Celebrity poker. So, but not Jonathan Frakes in theirs. No, I don't remember who was in theirs. But. I feel like Frakes did that gig just because he was, he was bored. I don't even think he needed the money necessarily. He's got that Riker Dude, money. It, it was next generation shit. That's high tech shit. He's got to be a part of it. Yeah, that's true. That's true. He probably was like, yeah, sure. I'll, I'll, thank you. Thank you for asking. Meanwhile, they went to Patrick Stewart, Brent Spiner, LeVar Burton, Marina Sirtis, Reg Barclay, O'Brien, Morph. <laughs> they went to everyone else, and they're like, uh, Riker, you want to do this? I mean, Jonathan. And then they were like, <laughs> Jonathan, Charlotte, Jonathan, Charlotte! Yeah! Miss every shot! <laughs> Will you ever play TNG DLC for Star Trek Bridge Crew? I've never even played Bridge Crew. Bridge Crew I haven't either. Cool. I've heard it's alright, though, yeah. Yeah, it's alright. I... I, I think if you get it on sale with the DLC, maybe it's worth it. All I saw from Bridge Crew was wacky streamer shenanigans. I'm sure there's a lot of wacky streamer shenanigans. I would probably be wacky a little bit, but I'd also want to, like, pretend Star Trek was me. So I'd, I'd you know, get into I'm it. I'm not a huge Star Trek Go full fan, full but RP. I thought it was okay. Target marked. What VR do you have, John? I have a vibe. Uh, oh. oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But I don't, I don't believe you need to buy for it. I think you can. I think you can play it not in VR. Too. I'm sure you can. Yeah, I'm sure you can play it. However, they used to have be partnered with that Watson thing, so you can give voice commands. I think they fucked that up and computer like that. Like that kind of shit. Yeah. Oh yeah. They were using Watson to like interpolate the, the voice and the text and the commands and shit, and I think they fell out or didn't pay or something weird happened, and they it doesn't work anymore. Enemy advanced UAV overhead. Enemy soldier incoming. Yo, we got this. We're actually doing pretty good. What, what place are we in? I can't tell. Fourth. Fourth. Oh, okay. No, I see it. I see it. But we're actually not horrendously far behind. Yeah, you definitely want to play with people you know. We need eyes in the sky. This is Falcon Zero. Good copy. UAV beginning flyover. Enemy UAV overhead. Is there like armor pickups in this game mode? Nope. No. Yeah. Are there armor pickups? Says the English major. To Ooh. Just got a triple kill with that cluster strike. Ally defense to the overhead. Be the airspace is just way too crowded for me to call in any kind of cluster fucks right now. Just gotta spam that button. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I, have, I have extremely, extremely annoying laughs. Uh, oh, did you fucking jump off? A uh, fucking rock and die? No, I forgot to. I caught my parachute and I forgot to re engage the parachute. Hostile dropping into enemy UAV overhead. That's the time. Good thing you packed multiple shoots. This is Builder 2 0. Oh, bitch. 
I like your handheld business thing. Just like when I was in Wildwood as a kid. Yeah, laser sights were really big, or lasers, you know. It was like everyone was just shining them out in the street, middle of the night. Big laser energy? Does not seem very safe. We didn't know that it was at the time. It was 1998. When I was in college, I had a green laser that was bright enough that you could see the beam. Just, like popping it all over campus. I don't know how I didn't get in John, I still have a laser that can light matches and pop balloons. Oh, yeah, those are sick. Is it one of the blue ones? Arctic something or other. Yeah, I forget yeah. what it's called. I ha it's a blue one, yeah. Those are pretty sick. I don't know what you do with it besides the novelty of like the, the novelty wore fire. off quickly. Yeah. I was gonna say it, it was it was cool for a little bit. I don't know why. I, you know what? I I could use it to blind people. Great, yeah. Wow. In self defense, perhaps. I could see that going while someone attacks you and you just start screaming and waving your laser around at their face. Wait, hang on, I gotta get my laser. I used my lightsaber on you, assassin. Vinny, that's literally a war crime. Let me. Let, let I mean, me we are check playing with Ronald Call Reagan Duty. real quick, and then I'll let you know. Um, You're allowed to commit war crimes in self-defense, right? It, yeah, in Call of Duty, you are at least. Not about real life, but I'll I'll, I'll I'll look into it. I'll call Geneva. I have a uh, yeah. I, this laser is cool, and I have filters for it that make like shapes and everything. But I don't really know why I why I have it. Uh, it was it was a mistake purchase. But, uh, you know, there's like a, a command. You have to press the button, the on button, like three times and then hold it two times. So, like, if you're being attacked by an intruder, like an, an alien, let's say, you're gonna fuck you that just up. throw it at him. Yeah, you're gonna just, like, hit them with the, with the back of it. You get one of the ones in the key lock, the interlock. We're doing so good, though. What does that mean? They have ones you have to actually like put a key in and turn it in order to turn on. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah. Did you ever see those like million lumen LED flashlights that uh, light up a whole forest yeah. and could blind someone and they only last for like 10 minutes and they get really hot? I've seen what people water cool those <laughs> of like PC water coolers. Yeah, yeah. Pretty crazy. They just destroy the earth. Artificial sun? It's unnatural. It shouldn't happen. Agreed. I'm against light bulbs as well. Just putting that out there. Oh, cool. Are you, are you playing without a monitor then? Yeah. I'm a, I have no backlight on my monitor. I just am used to the darkness. Game Boy Advanced? I'm uh, much further than advanced, sir. What's that, that fucking Game Boy with the crank? <laughs> the, um... Uh, it's an analog teenage engineering thing. What the fuck is it called? The uh, crank the play date? Yeah, the play date. There's a... So, I was looking at a little video and it said Stanley Parable platform reveal. And it it's like, oh, we, we ported Stanley Parable over to this thing. And then it's just a video of a stick bug. So, never mind. Whoa. Mm. The power of... Modern technology uh, continues to amaze me. It's still just I a think black that and white game console. There's no way they get some standing power on anything there. interesting come out of it yet? All I saw was it seemed like a dumb gimmick for the sake of... I don't think many people this. have them yet that ordered them. It's out? Yeah, they nope. did pre-orders a while ago. It says it, it will ship in 2020 is what the website says. So it does not yeah. appear to have shipped. I think the only people that have them are developers. I mean, for um, dev, it's a fun little thing to do, just make a game for li limited hardware, but... Yeah. I mean, a crank? Crank that. Game Boy. Um, I do like... I saw Teenage Engineering partnered with Analog to design it, and I like a lot of Teenage Engineering stuff. I have an OP-1, which is like their synthesizer, and it's really nice. Um... Their things are, like, about a mix of, like, design and having fun, and less about being, like, all-encompassing, like, uh, full-featured things. They're intentionally designed to kind of piss you off when you use them. I didn't realize Analog was involved in that. 
Yeah, it's analog and teenage engineering. Build quality makes sense if analog's involved. Penny, have you seen yeah, the both. Th 3D GBA homebrew? No, link me to that when you get a chance, please. Oh, I saw that. It was pretty impressive. You know what it is? Okay. Is it something that you can play? Uh, if you like walking around in a maze, yeah. There's there's no game mechanics. It's just an attack demo of doing like 3D FPS rendering. I'm interested. I like seeing that shit. But sorry to interrupt. You were talking about some other shit. I don't even remember what I was talking about. Yeah. Uh, analog making good stuff. Uh, yeah. Uh, teenage engineering makes really nice, really good stuff too. Have you guys um, ever seen the Wii the shoved into an Altoids tin? Oh, what? We shoved what? into an Altoids tin. I thought you said bees in an Altoids tin. <laughs> no. <laughs> Just throw it at someone. <laughs> like, leave the lid slightly <laughs> unhinged. Slightly ajar, right, yeah. Um, I was gonna- someone mentioned that the OP1 was $1,200. That's another thing I kind of don't like about Teenage Engineering. Is when I bought it, it was eight hundred dollars. But they don't. They like stop making their products after a few years, and they just let them get way more expensive. And they only ever release very small amounts of them. And th that's probably going to be the same, unless Analog convinces them otherwise. That's Analog probably going to be how. Um, runs. That's probably how it's going to be with this thing too. Which I get. It's a collector's angle. If I were a video game collector, I, I probably would have got that crank boy. Crank that boy. I'm so sorry I said that. <laughs> what was the thing? The boy circus? Yeah, from... Yeah, the, the Farm Finders game. Yeah. I'd play a boy circus game on the crank boy. That's a weird statement without context, mate. I'm usually the one who says the weird shit. Just, um, practicing. I learned from the- you, I learned from you. I'm learning from watching you! I- I wanted to mention there was a thing that I wanted to talk about. No, I don't, because I forgot. That must have been, uh... Real important! Yeah. Was it the gamer car from earlier? No. Okay, gamer car? Did you not see- Oh yeah, you said you only watched part of the opening. Yeah, I didn't watch the whole thing. Uh, so Ford and Forza designed a gamer car. Um, Forza. Yeah, it's the Forza. Uh, and they are making a real version of it at some point. And it looks like- I don't even know how to describe it. You just need to see the picture of it. Didn't Forza do like a Lego car at some point? Yeah, and then they had it on For, like, stage. Some Lego DLC. Well, shit. I, I, they, I, that's what I got free with my Mario Lego. I got a f little Forza Ferrari, Forza Lambo. I forget. I doesn't. I don't know. How fast does it go? As fast as my arm. Yeah. Fast as fuck for you. It was only 70 pieces, so it's a real small one, but I like it. it it's one of those things where. You know, you go into a Lego store for the first time in years, and you feel a little guilty that you're even doing that for unknown weird reasons. And then they give you, like, three free things with your purchase, and then you're like, I love Lego again. Yeah, there's the video. <laughs> they really called it the Fordzilla? Yes. When I and first read it, I just thought of quesadillas, because I'm hungry right now. I quote the guy, when he announced it, said, A car designed with gamers for gamers. With that gamers like for gamers. Accident. Yeah. I gotta say, I think our momentum is uh, dropping a bit as our brain slowly uh, yeah. oozes out of our, sc our skull. Holes. My 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 brain was not good tonight to begin with. Enemy UAV overhead. Hostile dropping in. At least in this game mode, you don't have that stinging pain of when someone wipes your team with their That's true. gold loads. How, how did you survive the full magazine? Like, yeah, he I guess he regenerated health. It was like almost... 
It was like 10... Alright, it wasn't a full magazine, it was like 10 shots. And then it was, um, a car 98 bullet. Purple. I never get tired of the guy calling out like the UAVs and the kill streaks and shit. He's like my bro. <laughs> I wonder what his name is. Gustav. Gustav sounds like a war name. Yeah, Gustav. Yeah, I don't have any any shoot left in me tonight. I don't think. Uh, I got kicked because I did the authenticator and it kicked me out and I logged back in. I just believe it me. I'm just I'm on a locking in. Pretty good authenticator if it kicks you when you use it. Yeah, great. I don't know, maybe like they need like a day for the Activision account to like propagate into their servers or some bullshit. I don't know. So I thought you could play even without an Activision account, but maybe I'm wrong. Probably not. That wouldn't make sense. Pretty they, sure. they gotta make it as annoying as possible. I think it's required required to cross play. And wars and required to cross play. Motherfuck. I was gonna say maybe they have like a team of employees that have to like manually go through each person. Have to copy and paste from one terminal window to another to get it to work. They're all at home right now. It's all, yeah, it's all analog. It's like, just like, in Saving Private Ryan, when the, the, they're typing up, like, the, the notes for the, the parents. It's just like a room full of people on typewriters. I also can't wait to get four million emails from Activision. Oh, we just traded, we just traded kills. God, Nary, I thought you were a bad guy. That's not very nice. All the credits say additional voice, so that's his name. Announcer has been discovered. Additional voice is his name. The name's voice. Additional voice. That's a pretty badass name for a voice actor. It's a good thing it worked out. Well, we're in the top 10. You know, we only gotta get another 40 kills to catch up. Wow. Miss every shot, please. Eat eight games. Miss every shot. This isn't even an EA game. This is a lack of vision. Lack, lack of vision. Everything. Do they even still use that intro anymore? Is this even this is even Activision? Is it? Oh yeah, it is. It is. It's published. No. Attack Blizzard. Still EA's fault somehow. Big think hard. Easy think nice. EA blame good. It's easier to blame Activision at this point than EA. Which is impressive. It's really fine. But, I mean, listen. After what happened with Warcraft 3, re-punted. Re re there's nothing I really would like more than to just shit on Activision.
But, you know, here I am playing their video game, so... I mean, maybe DICE will put out a good battle royale with the next battlefield, but I doubt it. I hope they just don't even bother trying to do battle royale in the next battlefield and instead come up with a new mode that fits the game well. Because the, the yeah. thing they did in Battlefield 5 was fucking embarrassing. Embarrassing, I'll tell you. Well, it's just like... This is a... I, well, not this game mode that we're playing now, but... What... What they did with um, Warzone I thought was really smart. They gave it away for free. They really made it... Uh, a lot of quality of life adjustments. May not be to everyone's liking. But it's somewhere in between like a PUBG and a Fortnite in terms of like accessibility. It's got the the Call of Duty like engine and gameplay, so it's you've already got a lot going for you. It, they did a good job with this. Yeah. So I'm happy with this, but I also think like if I'm gonna buy a Battlefield game, I'll just play Battlefield. Like I want that. I don't need. Not every game needs to do a battle royale game mode. It's like yeah. it's not, you know you don't have to chase the trend for every game. I mean, luckily, the only two that really chased the trend were Battlefield and Call of Duty, and then, well, Firestorm failed, and nobody remembers Blackout. Everyone just remembers Yeah, this. that's true, that's true. Uh, I mean, Blackout failed for a variety of reasons, mainly because it was a Battle Royale inside of a $60 game. And hey, Apex succeeded, but... Yeah. Every single... Outside of PUBG and Fall Guys, every single successful Battle Royale is free to play. Only flaw is that Warzone is over 200 gigabytes. Yeah, it's it's a pretty tough barrier of entry for a lot of people. It's gonna be 300 gigabytes with all the Black Ops content added. Oof. Wait, 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 wait. So what are that? Is that what they're doing with this? So, what? What? Okay, so we don't have full information on what they are doing, but they confirmed that the game that Warzone will get Black Ops content. That is all they've confirmed, but. It would be stupid to compete with themselves, so it doesn't make sense for Treyarch to put out a battle royale because they'd be competing with themselves. All right, when they can just but, build from this as a platform. Yeah, so my guess is they'll probably pull Warzone out of Modern Warfare and turn it into its own game, um, turn it into its own client, remove 100 gigs from the download because you don't need Modern Warfare, and then they can merge everything in, but who knows what they're actually gonna do. Merge because the game. The, the, the trailer for Black Ops implied that there was a new map for Warzone, but... Whoa, it's my game is park. glitching out. Yeah, I'm done. It's it's almost yeah. four. But well, I just see a blank screen now. It's just yeah. the... It looks like Jeff's screen almost, except there's no text. It's it. This is, again, like, I really like oh, yeah. Sorry, every you. now and then playing um, a game of... of you know, like Warzone, it really is like a good podcast game. Truthfully, like it kind of it's just fun to just bullshit about other random shit while shooting. Uh, and it's you know the gameplay itself is a lot of fun. So I would love for them to keep it as is and just add content to it. Like the the it works, it's good. Make it its own client. I like that idea. And then just add like a new map. Add the blackout. Uh, sorry, the Black Ops guns, characters, etc. And I think that's great. I think that's a good idea, a good way to go about it. You already have this. And then, dude, if World of Warcraft can still release an expansion with the same crusty visuals, I know there's People been some addicted. improvements. People are addicted to that. Yeah. You can, like, Gotta use some that. of these games and these engines for years, and people will still buy it. But, you know, that's just, again, one easy way for them to go about it, which is just reuse the same thing and add. But I wonder, like, if they're adding new things to the engine for Black Ops, I wonder if that will affect Warzone in any way. Because I'm assuming every Call of Duty game, they, they improve the code and they, they try to, like, beef it up a little bit in various ways. So I thought the game was on the... So what they did, I thought it was on the Modern Warfare engine, but according to Digital Foundry, it's on its own Treyarch engine. So <laughs> I don't even know at this point because they oh. haven't talked about it. Gotcha. 
Uh, so we'll find out probably on the 9th when they do the multiplayer reveal and we see what the hell they're doing. Yeah, stop advertising for McDonald's and Call of Duty, Nary. <laughs> hey, at Dropping least dates. I'm not donating to advertise. <laughs> there you go. Uh, I don't really think... Uh, like, in terms of the single player of Black Ops, maybe it'll be kind of cool. I don't know. Like, I, I don't... A lot of you know that for me, a lot of this shit doesn't, like, get me too excited whenever they reveal a new Call of Duty. Like, for a while, it was just, okay, more of the same, another shoot. And then I realized, like, well, they're solid shoots. And I, like, Warzone revitalized this whole, like, franchise for me. Um, so... You know, I might check out Black Ops. I'm, they might send me a code like they've been, truthfully. Like, they, that's why I play these games. They send me a fucking code. I'm like, yeah, I'll play it. <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't know if I'd be buying them on Maybe my own well, otherwise. Right? Right? Yeah, I'll, I'll check them out. And then I kind of get a little addicted for like a week or two. And then this one ended up holding my attention a lot longer. I think it's a good game. I played very little of the single player because it didn't stream very well. So when it comes to Black Ops, I might check it out. I might even play some of the single player. But mostly it's just more of this. And if they can build on this platform that is Warzone, then uh, I'll play it. But I don't think I'll... I'm not losing my shit over these trailers. I don't need to see Ronald Reagan, like, parody impression, you know, Cold War stuff. Like, that's not, it's not blowing me away. Going back to Gamescom today, there was nothing there that really blew me away. It was just a couple of cool games. Some nice trailers. It was fine. So, yeah, that's how I feel about it. I'm always kind of iffy about Call of Duty anyway. Vinny, there's a big new update for Hypnospace Outlaw available now. I'm going to look into that for maybe next week. I'll I'll, uh, I'll let you know what I decide, chat, if uh, if there's enough content in there to stream again. They did a Switch release too, I think, right? They did, yeah. yeah. With mouse support too. Oh, for the Switch. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's sick. Mm -hmm. So, anyway, guys, thanks for joining. It was fun. Yep. Sorry, yeah, good games. Crazy. It's all right, Gear. Not your fault. Yeah, it's Activision's fault, most likely. Yeah. All right. Well, maybe next time we'll get uh, John in a game. But uh, have a good night, guys. Thanks for uh, thanks for chatting with me. See ya. Yeah. Peace. Yep. Bye. See you. All right. All right, chat. Um, let's do. Let's do the art. Oh, right. Nary's corruptions. I'll, I'll do that. Let's see. If I end up, Chad, if I end up streaming um, tomorrow, I would finish uh, one or two of the games I've been streaming. But I don't know if I'll be streaming tomorrow. A, I feel a little bit trash. B, I was thinking about taking a vacation again. Like a small two-day va vacation, but I don't know. The weather's going to be kind of not great, so I don't know if I'm going to do that now. Oh, that's a good, that's a good crust. Jesus. The fuck? <laughs> what game? Oh, man, this reminds me of what happens to vehicles in, um... Oh, there's a game on Steam where you could, like, really fuck up cars. I forget exactly uh, what the name of it was. Beam NG, yeah. It's, it's like Beam NG vehicle destruction. All right, chat. Thank you for joining me for Chill Stream tonight. I hope uh, you all have a good night. I'm going to do some art now. And uh, I'll be finishing up those games soon. Next week, like I said, I'll be doing some variety shit. And then eventually... I'd like to uh, go through some of the, the, the older games I've been meaning to stream but haven't had a chance to. And then look into some newer shit too. But 
thank you again, everybody. Seriously. Uh, sorry, I wasn't really... Honestly, there are a lot of days I'm not on point, <laughs> but I appreciate people sticking around anyway.